Hello everyone, Rich here, back for part 4 of this SS Andrea Doria tutorial. Uh, today's focus will be the ship's boat deck superstructure. Uh, the ship's uh, bridge wings and upper deck superstructure. And well, basically everything above the boat deck effectively. Uh, if we go to the prototype we can sort of see uh, about 3 decks worth of uh, bits we're going to do today. So we've got the boat deck superstructure which is down here. Then the next deck up there which will support the bridge wings. And then the final deck house which will be the ship's wheelhouse and bits behind that so that's what we're going to do today hopefully so what we're going to do we're going to fly over to our build area and go to the front wall of this of the uh, boat deck superstructure so we've got this curved wall here which we built in part three and we're going to go to the center block and on the wood you're going to count back to the fifth block so one two three four five and on the fifth block I shall put a color block to mark the center I just make sure that it's the fifth one two three four five yep that's fine so that's the center block there and then you're going to build this wall uh, 11 wide, so that's uh, 5 either side. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 1, 2, 2, 3, 4, 5. There we are, that's 11 wide like so. And then we want uh, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then 3, 1, 2, 3, 3 again, 1, 2, 3, and then 2, and 2, like so, and then 2 back like that. I did the same the other side just to get this curved wall out of the way. So it's sort of it's five this side, so one, two, three, four, five, and then three, three, two, two, and then back two. And there we go, that's the front wall like so. So that's the curve like that. And then I'll go back to the left hand side and we'll build the rest of it. Uh, so what we're gonna do now is build along the deck and what we're gonna do from this row of two or three, whichever, you're gonna build back uh five, so one, two, three, four, five. And then 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And then uh, 144. So uh, that's the first block. You just want to build it 144 four long. So I measure from the first block and then I build it freehand. So you want it 144 four long, like the uh, inside walls. And uh, it should all be fine. So 144 or 144 four in length. That sh is the length you are after. And see how far that is now, just measure it, and that is 87, so still a bit to go, and that is 120, and that is 138, 139, 140, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, so that should be 144, and yep, that's 144, so there we are, it's 144 blocks long for that side, uh, and then we want to go one block so out to one side and we want to add uh, 13 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 so it's 13 like so so you've got the 1 4 4 there and then the 13 just one block out and then we're going to curve back in again so at the end of the 13 we want um, row we want 4 so 1 2 3 4 and then 2 like so and then we build inwards 4 so 1 2 3 4 like so and then two, like so. So we're curving back in again. We're curving round. Now we're going to curve or build forward again. So at the end of the two, we want uh, four. One, two, three, four. And then two. No, hang on. No, 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 no. Hang on. So it's four, two. And then what was it we want? We want. Th hang on. Is it? It's three. Sorry. So we want one, two, three. There we are. That's right. And then we want thirteen. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Like so, and then we go inwards four towards the centre, so one, two, three, four. And then forward again five. One, two, three, four, five. And then back towards the centre again, six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then add another coloured centre block. And that should be <laughs> that should be the centre. So I just fly to the back here to the end of the deck to make sure that it's the centre so that it's in line with the centre block. It is as well, so that's the centre block of the previous deck. And the build we just done is in line there. So you can see we got the uh, that's one half of the superstructure done, or the, the foundations of it. So we do the same thing on the other side. Kind of looks like uh, an odd shape. <laughs> Answers on a postcard. Uh, so I did the same on the other side to get it out of the way, and then we can build this the structure upwards. So uh, we'll do the same this side. So what is it? It's five. So one, two, three, four, five. Uh, and then twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And then, um, what is it, 144, so I've 
I'll try and do it with a uh, world edit. So it's two one four four. So that's uh, two eighty eight. And so if I go to two eighty eight, that should be the length we want. Is that the right length? Yep, that's fine. <laughs> just making sure. So set uh, quartz. So I was just using doubles to uh, measure that. So bear with me. I've just got an itch in my ear. Right, there we go. Right, so uh, that's the one four four there, and then on the outside we want one block out, and we add. Uh, where is it? Oh, one, well, thirteen. Sorry, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and then we curve back in again. Four, one, two, three, four, and then two, and then in four, one, two, three, four, and then two, like so, and then curve back forward. We want uh, three, one, two, three. And then 13. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Uh, and then in 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. And then forward 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then 6 across. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And that is in line with the centre block. And there we go. There's the foundations of our deck. And it should look something like that. Rather suggestive, but uh, each to their own. Uh, and then what you want to do is all these walls we just built, all the way around, you just want to increase that to three blocks high. So I should do a few blocks of it, because it's going to take forever, forever otherwise. So I'll do a f the first few bits and then just increase it all the way around to three blocks high. So, so, so well, you, got the, you get the idea anyways, that's how it's meant to look when, you, when you're building it. So build it all three blocks high, all the way around. Uh, and it should look it should look fine. So I shall do a jump cut while I'd finish that off and then we'll uh, move on. So I'm um, back in a moment. Right, back again and I've increased the walls to three blocks high now and they should all look something like that. As you can see three blocks high. So what we're gonna do now is fly to the back end of the ship superstructure that we've just built and I just want to get this little job out of the way first, which uh consists of this back section here, the centre section, because where you can see it's rather square at the moment. Uh, the next two rows on top will be curved, so we're going to go down to the centre block at the back here, and on the centre block we're going to build up two, like so, and then two up either side of that, like that, and then we're going to build the curved wall around. Now this curved wall will go as far around, around the back of the uh, testicle areas here, <laughs> and around to the, where the wall narrows slightly, so basically to that point there. So we'll worry about that in a second, but we'll get the curve out of the way first. So on the bottom of that row of three now, so it's a, it's a row of three, and on the bottom of it, what we're going to do is build uh, a row of three, so one, two, three, and then four rows of two, so one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, and then two back, and then you want uh, three rows of three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, like so. And I'll do the same on the other side. So I'll add the three, one, two, three, and then the four rows of two. So one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, and then two back, and then the three rows of three. So one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, like so. And that just just goes up to the the uh, deck house, you know, up to the uh, superstructure wall. And now what we'll do, we'll go back over to where the uh, wall narrows. So you've got this one, four, four, one hundred and forty-four block long line there, like so. So what we're going to do is from where the uh, outside section begins here, we're just going to build from there and build along the top of the existing wall around the back of the said dangly bits at the back. Well, that's what that looks like anyway, and then just connect it up to the uh, the curved wall at the back there. And then what you do is go back to the centre and double it in height. So as you can see the centre is two blocks high. We need that all the way around to that side panel now. So we'll just build that all the way around. Build it all the way around so that it's five high up to the end of that section there, like that. So there we are. So you can see the one four four section is three blocks high, and this section is now five blocks high. So that's what we wanted to achieve. So I do the same on the other side now. So I don't oh, go back over to this section, and we add our line across the top of the back walls up to the end there, and then double that in height. And across the curve, <coughs> excuse me. And there we go, and that's that curved section done. As you can see, you've still got the square walls, but now you'll have a curved sort of canopy uh, 
roof sort of thing so that's how that should be there and then when we come to add the deck the deck will sit on top of these walls here on the inside uh, or will they? hmm makes me wonder uh, i just pop over to the prototype a second because I just want to make sure I've done this right because uh, at, least, at least then you'll get an idea of what it's meant to look like so the, there you can see you've got the curved walls and then you've got the inside square walls there and uh, the deck will not sit on actually on top of those walls there but uh, the deck will uh, I'm trying to work out how this works. Um, so yeah, those those walls on the inside there, they need to be increased to uh, four blocks high now. So actually, I'll go back over and uh, we'll do this properly now. So what we're going to do now is the the square walls now that are now inside or sort of behind the curve now, we just need to increase them to four blocks high. So where the curve is there, we'll just increase these walls on the from the centre going out, increase them to four blocks high back up to the curve there, so there we are, so that when we add the deck, the deck will sit on top of these walls now as you can see like that, the deck will sit there so I should do the same on the other side, so increase just these three walls or four walls, sorry, so one, two, three, four, yeah, four walls, increase them to four blocks high and there we go, that's that little job done there, so like I say, the deck will now sit on top of those walls and uh, we won't have a problem Right, so that's the back end done, so what we're going to do now is fly over to the front end and do that wonderful job. Uh, I need a piece of paper here, so with my notes on, and I've not written it down. Well, I've written it down, but I'm not putting it somewhere where I can find it. So bear with me. Right, back again. I uh, had to do a jump cut there. I found my notes, but the game crashed, which is not helpful. Anyway, back to the front wall, and uh, what we're going to do now is on the row of 11 at the front here, so this front wall here, uh, which is already three blocks high, we're going to increase it to uh, five blocks high, so... We just add another two rows across the front, like so, so it's five high like that. And then for the row of five, and the two rows of three, we increase them to five high as well. So there's the row of five, there, and then the two rows of three, like so, increase them to five high. Now do the same the other side, just to get it out of the way. So we do the five, like so, and then the two rows of three, like that, so there we are, there's the front wall like so and now we're going to build out the overhanging uh, side deck, so uh, from the uh, row of two now, so we've just got just got the five the three and the three there done, so now we'll go to the row of two behind that and we're going to build a line of three on top so one, two, three like that so you've got one block overhang like that and then you want another four rows of three after that, so one, two, three one, one, two, three one, two, three one, two, three out to the side and then a row of two so one two like that out to the side and then you want uh, well, double that in height then increase that so it's two blocks thick like so like that so now it's, you can see it's as thick as the uh, well as high as the front wall and then you, from that row of two you want to build back uh, 13 so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen and then from there you want to build 10 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 like that and then you need to build back inwards again you're going to build in 6 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 uh, it says 6 but yeah yeah build it in uh, across 6 so it doesn't it doesn't attach to the deck house so you build it in 6 so you should have a gap in that area there so it's not attached so that's that and then what we'll do is we'll increase that in height as well so it's in height, it's the same height as the front wall and it should look something like that like that, so you've got this overhang section there so I'll do the same on the other side now so from that last row of three we build out uh, four ro no, five rows of three, so one, two, three, 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 one, two, three. and then two, one, two, and then we build back uh, 13 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 and then 10 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 and then inward 6 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 and as you can see does not attach to the deck house there and so what we do now and increase the height of that so it's the same height as the rest of said deck or wall on the front All the way up to the front, uh, to the side there, like that. So there we are. There's that, uh, that uh, overhang section there, like that. 
So what we're going to do now is to build an overhang section. So from where the row of six goes in towards the deckhouse but does not attach to it, we're going to build a line of blocks now overhanging the side of this uh, this wall. So we're going to build is a line which should be, I don't know, about 147 blocks in total. But it basically it, it attaches to that. If I just fly down to the back end, actually, it should attach to that first section we've done earlier. So when you build it all the way along the side, it will attach to this wall here at the back, which is already five blocks high. So it'll attach here. It'll attach to that section there. So I don't know how long, how many blocks it is. Um, but we'll just build it freehand. It should be fine. So what we do, we just build along the bottom. So to build the bottom line, just build all the way along the side. And like I said, it should attach to that section I just showed you. So I'm not going to bother me. I'm not going to bother counting it. So we'll just build it all the way back. And it should attach fine. In theory. Up to there like so. And then double that in height. So it's the same height as the rest. We're nearly there yet. Yeah, nope, nearly there. And there we go. That's that section done. And it should look something like that. So you got the overhang there. Now it's just what it's just one block overhang, but it's still an overhang as such. Um, and it should look all something like that. Now, when we built the, uh, the lower walls, we built them three blocks high. But really, I think that should have been four blocks high because the deck is going to sit one block above. So the inside walls now, all the way down to the back. Uh, this wall here we can increase that to four blocks high so on the inside we just increase it to four blocks high all the way down the length of the ship as you can see we just build it in this groove as well so when we add the deck the deck will sit up here like so, so that's where the deck will sit so I'm just going to build this line all the way down uh, to the back end actually I'll do it with a weld edit it'll take a bit of time and then it should be fine I should build it down to uh, that so set quartz if I can find it. There we are, and there we are. That's increased to four blocks high. And like I said, the deck will now sit in that groove there, and it's not changed anything on the outside, so that's fine. So I'll do the same the other side with that uh, row going on the outside. So I shall go from the back end here. We we'll just build it freehand. Actually, sorry, I'll just do weld edit because it just saves a lot of time. But you know what we're doing is just exactly the same as what we just done on the other side. So increase, uh, build the line along the outside. Now we just do the same thing there. Oh, hang on. And there we go. There's the overhang on the side, like so. And then the inside walls, we can now increase them to four blocks higher, which is something I should have done to begin with, but never mind. So increase that to four high, all the way along, and everything should be magic in theory all the way down to the back there there we go so that's that section done there and now we've got the uh, the walls all complete all the way around so now what we're going to do is fly to the front end and we're going to start <coughs> adding the deck now as you saw the deck will sit on top of those inside walls so the deck goes if, along the front wall just build the deck along the top line of the said front wall at the front here and everything should be okay. So just build that deck all the way to the back and everything should be fine. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to stand on the uh, wall over here and uh, use the fill tool. So fill wood by 30,000 and that's the first time I used it today. Right. Ah, there we go. That's the deck added there or it's still filling in over there. Just go along the side, and yep, there we are, it's all filled in. So as you can see, you've got the curved wall at the back here now, which is all sorted. And uh, you've got the overhang, which is all fine. So like I said, the deck is in the right place. And then we go around the other side, everything's fine there. And we'll fly to the front, back again, and we'll look at the outside edges. <coughs> and everything should be fine there. And there, yeah, not too bad, is it? It looks all right. So that's that job done there. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to do a jump cut while I uh, move on to the next job. And uh, we shall carry on from there. So um, 
back in a moment. Right, back again. So what we're going to do now is move on to our next job and go to the front wall of the uh, the deck we just done. So the, the deck with the uh, overhanging sides. Uh, and we're going to start building the next section of deck house uh, or superstructure rather. So we're going to the center block of the front wall again of the top section, and we're going to leave a uh, well count to the fourth block back on the wood. So one, two, three, four. And I'll put our center block. And we're going to build this wall nine blocks wide. So that's uh, four other sides. So one, two, three, four that way. One, two, three, four that way. And then uh, that's nine wide. And then we're going to build the side curve. So it's going to be five. One, two, three, four, five. And then uh, one, two, three, four, five. Five rows of three. So one, two, three. 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 And then two. One, two, like that. And then for the sides, we want uh, six, so one, two, three, four, five, six. And then back inwards, four, one, two, three, four, like that. And uh, that's that section done there. So I'll do the same the other side, so we'll get this shape out of the way. So we'll do the five, one, two, three, four, five. And then the five rows of three, one, two, 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 three. And then the two, one, two. And then, uh, what was it? Six, six along, so one, two, three, four, five, six, and then four in, one, two, three, four, and there we go, there's our sort of hammerhead sort of shape, and then from that side, row of four, which is built in, we're going to build the side walls, which are 90 blocks long, that's nine zero blocks long, so I should build the first block, and measure from there, I'm just going to look over at the prototype, make sure I'm doing this right, uh, so yeah, so that's the first block, we'll just build 90 in length, so that's number one, and we'll just build 90 all the way along the side. So this should take a few seconds. Do 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 do. Biddy biddy ba boo. So, so how, ooh, how fast that? That is. That's 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90. Let's make sure. Yep, that's 90. So that's the 90 block section there. And then we want to build inwards two. So two towards the center. And then we want to add 21, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, like so, so that's 21, so 90 into, and then 21. And then at the end of the 21, we want to build outwards again, 3, 1, 2, 3, and then we want to build uh, 17, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, like so, and then we want 2, at the end of that, two in like that, and then we want to build uh, inwards three, one, two, three, and then two again on the inside of that. So we're building the curve back round. So it's uh, two inwards three, inwards two, and then we're going to build forward. After that, we're going to build eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, like so, and then three, one, two, three, and then two rows of two. So one, two, one, two, and then two in like that. And then we want six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then a colour block to mark the centre. So that should be the centre line. Like so. So that's half of the deck done. So when you do the other side, you'll still have a sort of spanner shape like that. But I just make sure that that is the centre line. So I just go from that block down to the back wall here. And yep, that's the centre. So I'm just making sure there. And so that is half of the foundations done. So I just fly back to the front end. And. Uh, Make sure we do this again. So I do the same this side. So I build the 90. So I put block number one. And then I build it freehand. So it shouldn't take too long. In theory. Don't worry about those two blocks. I'll remove, oh, I don't need to remove them because we're going to build the wall up anyway. So not a problem. That's gone too far. So one, two, three, four, five, six over. So that is. There we go, 90 there. <laughs> and then we build uh, two inwards, so one, two inwards. And then, what was it? It was 21, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 21. And then out three, 1, 2, 3. And then 17, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. <laughs> and then we wanted two, and then three inwards. And then two again, 1, 2. And then uh, so two, three, and two, and then we wanted what was it? Eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then three. One, two, three, and then two rows of two. One, two, one, two, 
and then N2, and then 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And that connects to the center line, and that is fine. So there we are. That is our foundations of our deck house. Sort of similar to the deck below, but a bit more of a, a more sort of less rounded curve. So that is that section done there. And then what we're going to do now is increase those walls. All the walls we just built there to three blocks high. So similar to the deck below, uh, we increase them to three blocks high. Now these will be three blocks high at the end because this this deck is one block lower than the rest of the deck. So that's the reason for that. So just build these walls that we just built here three blocks high, all the way around. I just did the first first couple so you can see what I'm on about. So just build them three blocks high, like so, and then just do that all the way around. So I should do a jump cut and then I shall come back when that's done. So uh, back in a moment. Right, back again. So that's the walls all increased to three blocks high, as you can see there. Got all those walls done. And, yep, three blocks high. So we're going to fly down to the front end now, back to the front of the ship, and we're going to start by adding the uh, bridge wings, effectively. So the front wall, which is uh, nine wide, we're going to increase that to four blocks high. So build the nine wall four blocks high. And then the five, and then the one, two, three, four, five, the, and then the five rows of three, increase them to four blocks high. So we do the five, and then the five rows of three, increase them to four blocks high, like so. I do the same the other side. So the five here, and then the threes, one, two, three, four, five, like so. They're all increased to five high, uh, to four blocks high, sorry, like so. And then for the bridge wings, what we're going to do is go back to that last row of three here. And behind that, you've got a row of two, which is there. On top of that, we're going to build three. One, two, three. And begins to overhang the side. So we built the three there. And then we want three more rows of three. So one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Out to the side. And then two. One, two. Uh, and then we want two back, like so. And then we want uh, two again, like that. And then we want to build... Hang on, I'm trying to work this one out. Let's build three inwards, so one, two, three. And then two rows of four, so one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, like that. And so your bridge wing should sort of go out and then curve back inwards like that. Or cur yeah, curve back inwards. And then this last row of four does not, and I repeat that, does not attach to this deck ha uh, to this wall below. So you should have a, a single block gap between the bridge wing and the, block and the wall there. So that is that. I do the same the other side. So you've got that last row of three. So from this row of two here, we add three. And then three more rows of three. So so it's basically four rows of three. So one, two, three. One, one two, three. One, two, three. And then two. And then two back. And then two back again. And then three in. One, two, three. And then two rows of four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And once again, you've got that gap in the side there like that. So there's your bridge wings added there. And it should look something like that. And then what we're going to do now is build an overhang again. Like similar to what we've done on the deck below, we've got an overhang. But this block, this one is two blocks wide, so you've got a bit more of a gap, a bit more of an overhang. So we'll go from the right-hand side. So from this row of four, this last row of four, we want to build the side uh, 58 blocks long. So I build a line 58 blocks long. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58. So there we are, 58 blocks long. And then what you do, you build inwards two, like that. So there's your 58 blocks long, and then you build in two to connect to the rest of the wall there. And then behind that, what we do, we build from this point round to the centre at the back there, we just basically increase the rest of the walls to four blocks high, all the way up to that centre block over there. So I do this freehand. So from that overhang, we just build it four blocks high, or increase it to four blocks high, all the way down to the uh, back, uh, down to the centre at the back. the center block which I've just gone over so there we are. there's the center block there down below this so I've done that from the overhang round to the center increase the walls to four blocks high so that's basically the rest of the walls so the area in front of where we attach the overhang so you've got the overhang here 
and then you've got that row of two going inwards, you should have that th that wall there th in here, three blocks high still. So the deck will sit in this groove here, like so. So that's where the deck will sit. So I do the same the other side. I won't bother counting it for, uh, by uh, what I normally do, so I just do it freehand. I measure it as I go along. So uh, it's 58 blocks long again. But like I said, I just do it freehand and then measure it as I get there. So how far is that? That is 41. How far is that? That is 58, that's fine. And then we build inwards two, and then the rest of it increase to four blocks high. And then it should all look fine and dandy. And then we up to the centre, and there we go, there's that wall done. So that is that section done there. So the bridge wings uh, and everything are now added. So we'll go back to the overhang. So if you remember what I just said, that the deck will sit in this groove here. So the deck is, like I said, the, the deck. this deck here is only a three block gap. So you've only got a three block gap between the bottom and the top of the walls, or the bottom between the decks basically. But the decks below, I've got a four block gap. So the decks are getting narrower, or lower rather, as we go higher. So. Um, this is only a three block gap so that's that so for that to add the deck now we go to the front wall again by the bridge wings and we just add the deck along the top of the white section of the front wall or the front wall of the white section rather so there we are there's the first few rows of wood blocks added there so you know where the deck goes and the deck goes right out to the bridge wings right in the corners so I just go right out to the edge so the bridge wings have their allocation of wood blocks like so and as you can see the deck sits on top of the inside wall so what I'll do now I shall stand here and use the good old fill tool so fill no not if we want fill wood by 30 bazillion and that should fill in all the wood decking and there we go that is the deck added there so I just look at the bridge wings they're all filled in that's fine and down to the back end just make sure that's right there and yeah, don't look too bad. So that is that deck done. So we've got quite a bit done so far today. And uh, we're not doing too bad. So another job we've got to do now, I'm just going to go over to uh, go over to the prototype a second. As you can see on the prototype, actually, we've got windows as well. Windows and doors on all the uh, on the deck. So we'll sort of sort that out later on. Uh, but first, I'm just going to work out what to do with the uh, side walls. I think what we'll do, this job I'm just trying to th <coughs> just trying to think of, we'll leave that, so we'll do that for another day. But I think what we'll do, we'll start adding the windows to the front walls now. So we've got windows across the front walls here, so we've got one, two, three decks of windows. So we'll start at the bottom, so we've got six across the front. So the bottom deck here, so we've got the folks all here. So the bottom wall, we'll add six windows there, and then one, two, one, one. Like so. so I'll add those windows over on the front now. So a six, was it six two or six one one one? I can't remember. It's a good start, isn't it? So anyway, we'll I'll add the first six windows. So I think they're a single block gap. So window, window, window. So that's three, and that's four, five, six. So you've got six windows across the front there, like so. I'm gonna have to go to the prototype again because I've forgotten how many I need to add. So it's six, uh, six one two one one. There we are. Right. So I should do the same again. So six one two one one. So back down to here, we add. So you could add the two, really. You could add two windows. So I think uh, we'll, we'll just add the one. We'll do it properly. So we'll add the one window, and then we'll add the two on this section. So it's six one two, and then one on each section here. So one there, and one there. There we are. There's the six two six one two one one. So I'll do the same on the other side. Six one. Two and then one, one, and there's the front windows for that section there. Not looking too bad. So I'll do the next deck. I'll just go and find out how they're laid out. And this deck is the boat deck actually. So we'll do the front windows, and then I'll explain the side windows because they're not really in any specific order. So we've got four across the front, and then it's one, one, one on this deck. So that's the middle deck. 
So it's four along the front, and then one, one, one out to the side. So I'll go back over to this wall on this side, and we'll do the four windows. So that's uh, one and two, three and four. So there's our four windows, and then we want one, one, one out to the side. So we'll add one, one, and one on each section there. Do the same the other side. So add our one there, one there, and one there. So there we are. There's our four, three, well four, one, one, one window there. That's the middle. Now for the top deck, I've forgotten already what I meant to do there. So I just fly over to that. So for the front wall at the top here, we add two on the front, and then it's one, 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 one. So it's basically two on the front and then singles down to the side. Uh, in theory you could put two in this one but we'll see. All right, so, it's t so it's two, one, space and then fours. Right okay I'll do the same. This could go one of many ways. So it's a three block gap in the middle so we'll go to the centre and we'll have a, leave a single block gap out to the side and put our single windows in. Like so, as you can see you've got a three block gap between those front windows. And then we've got one window here, and then a gap, and then we add four single windows, like so. So there we are, there's our, so it's two at the front, one, and then a gap, and then one, two, three, four, like that. So I'll do the same the other side. So I'll put our one in there, space, and then one, one, without doing damage, uh, and then one one there, there we are. That is that deck done there. And it should, in theory, look something like that. Nothing special, but you know, you get the idea. So that's the front walls sort of done. And now for the side walls, I've not really done anything special with this, because I normally sort of add the windows as I go along sort of between videos, but I haven't done that. But if I just fly over to the prototype, and you can sort of get an idea on what I, try, what I normally do. So we'll start on the boat deck, which is basically the middle deck here. What I normally do and if you're familiar with my previous videos, I usually do four or five windows and then a pair of doors and then sort of, well with this ship I sort of added seven or eight windows, so that's how many is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, well I added twelve windows for this one so it's I added four windows, doors and then twelve windows, and you can see there's a two, gap, two block gap between each door, uh, between each window and then twelve windows, doors 12 windows doors. So it's it's sort of it's not accurate to the real ship. I just sort of added windows just to decorate it a bit more. But if you if you can find photographs uh, or deck plans of the proper layouts of the windows, then by all means use them because you can get a better layout of what what to do. Whereas I've just done it at random. So like I say, it's just windows placed in random places. So it's the same on the inside as well on the inside of the promenade. I've not added any windows on the prototype, but I have in here on the Oh, this is the prototype, sorry. On the build, I've not added any windows. So in the prototype here, you can see we've got the, the same sort of thing. It's random placement of windows and doors, really. There's no uh, real placement. So if I fly around here, you can sort of see how they go there, I guess. It's the same again. Windows, which are not quite as spaced out in some places, and then they're a bit more spaced out again. So like I say, it's just, it's just a random placement of windows. Uh, but on the, upper, on the, uh, the back sections here, you've just got single windows on the back walls there so uh, I'm not going to give you a, a, a demonstration how to place them, I mean, I've just sort of showed you the rough idea so if I've, so I think but yeah, between this video and the next one I think I will add the windows and doors in a random fashion so it's not to uh, start anything uh, too political on this one, I don't want to get too too much into accuracy and inaccuracy of window placement because it just sort of <laughs> makes the, makes the uh, air a bit uh, stale if you know what I mean so we don't want to get too political in that anyway that is the, uh, the front windows done and I'll just sort of give you a demonstration of the rest of the windows sort of placed in random spots so if you want to add the windows and doors you can so I will do that between this video and the next one add the rest of the doors and windows but uh, that's that so I think what we'll do uh, I think we'll call it a day now because I, I did think about doing the shipped wheelhouse but I think I'll leave that till the next part um, or shall I? Uh, yeah, I think I'll leave it for now because it's getting a bit late. So we'll call it a day now. We've got two decks out of the way, two complicated ones. That last section with the ship's wheelhouse is not really that complicated, so we'll worry about that another day. So yeah, we'll uh, call it a day now, and I will 
sort those doors and windows out between now and the next video and uh, we'll go on from there so uh, yeah we'll leave it at that so this is Rich signing off locking off and disappearing and hopefully returning in part five so um bye for now